At a speak out tonight downtown, the head of the Vermont Racial Justice Alliance said, number one, this is a problem. Number two, I'm not surprised. He's talking about the 2021 incident in Burlington over which the city has just been sued. Fox 44's Mike Hoey joins us now live in the newsroom with more. Well, Lauren, the plaintiff in that suit, Kathy Austrian, offered a statement to the Racial Justice Alliance about the matter, and we got to hear it at the Speak Out event you mentioned, which she did not attend. As his mother, I was unable to protect my son in our own house. That's Vermont Racial Justice Alliance Executive Director Reverend Mark Hughes. He was sharing a statement from Kathy Austrian. I made a promise to my son to seek accountability and find justice for the harm done to him. Austrian has sued the city of Burlington on behalf of her son, whom she says stole vape pens from a gas station in May 2021. His experience as, as, a, as a black youth was the direct result of the actions of the Burlington Police Department. They created a medical emergency that stems for lack of training, oversight, and racial bias. Court documents show the teen had a history of behavioral, intellectual, and trauma issues and recently changed his ADHD medication. Austrian called police and told them all of this. Body cam video shows the boy struggling with officers as they handcuffed him and forced him to the floor. The suit accuses paramedics of wrapping his head in a bag, injecting him with ketamine, often used to induce unconsciousness, and determining him to have excited delirium. The Burlington City Attorney's Office has not replied to our request for comment, but Mayor Moreau Weinberger spoke with Lauren Maloney for Sunday's edition of What Matters This Week. There was, uh, consistent with an executive order that I put out in 2020, a um, thorough review by, by the city, including my office. The police commission reviewed it as well. The mayor says he knew ahead of the Tuesday court filing that a lawsuit was likely. There have been numerous conversations, uh, communications between the chief and, and the family and um, you know, that there was remained uh, dissatisfaction with the incident. And Lauren, Reverend Hughes says Burlington's Richard Kemp Center is hosting community public safety conversations tomorrow focused on racial justice. They'll take place at 4 o'clock. Live in the newsroom tonight, Mike Hoey, Fox 44 News. The mayor and I talked about a lot more. You can watch that full interview Sunday on What Matters This Week, 1030, right here on Fox 44.